Neon, the future of urban living. The world as we know it is developing so rapidly in technology that in 50 years we'll be using those flying cars we are familiar with in futuristic sci-fi movies. Nobody would have thought 30 years ago that we would have electric vehicles as we do today. The development of world technology is rising and many people are developing innovative ideas to make the world a better place. Welcome to today's video. The futuristic technological innovation that we will be talking about will be Saudi Arabia's futuristic neom legality, which they term the line. This video will explain how this megacity came to be, the prospects of this city, and why it is an incredible technological innovation in how human beings can live. This video will take an inside look into one of the most ambitious projects ever proposed, the neom line project. Before continuing, be sure to like and hit the subscribe button. The 21st century is a century of mega projects. These projects cost more than 1 billion US dollars, or even 10 billion US dollars to build, and require massive amounts of capital. And there has been no better example of a mega project than the new Egyptian initiative for the Red Sea, NIA, also known as the Neom Line Project. One of the most grandeur and most anticipated innovations of late is the Neom Line, a proposed innovation in Saudi Arabia. The New Egypt Oasis Mega Project is a planned set of industrial zones, hubs, and communities built from scratch along the Red Sea, near Hergada. The project will be spread across an area of 4,000 fedans, about 1,044 square miles, in the Red Sea government, beginning west of the town of El Kusi and extending east towards Sal Hashisha. It's part of a larger strategy to reposition Egypt as an innovation leader in the MENA region. NEOM aims to attract domestic and foreign investors with its focus on technology innovation and new industries. It will serve as a home for greenfield investment projects in biotechnology, digital media, artificial intelligence, advanced manufacturing, renewable energy, water sustainability, medical innovation, education, sports tourism, e-commerce logistics, and financial technology. What's so special about the NEOM project? The NEOM project is unique for many reasons. One, it's an entirely new project, so it won't be subject to the existing economic, social, and infrastructure realities. The project is expected to be built from scratch without the current restrictions and limitations in the rest of the country. Two, the project's ambition is huge and will not only be a place for industry and business activity, it will aim to be a self-sufficient community with excellent living standards and high quality of life, especially in terms of the social and cultural aspects. The NEOM project is planned to become a flagship example that can be used to encourage other investment projects in other parts of the country. NEOM will be a special administrative and financial zone in which the rules and regulations on taxation, customs procedures, etc. differ from those that apply in the rest of the country. According to NEOM, the line presents a novel approach to urban planning. Zero-gravity urbanism is the idea of overlaying city functions vertically while allowing individuals to move freely in all three directions, up, down, or across, to reach them. This idea layers schools, residences, workplaces, and public parks so that individuals can quickly move between them and accomplish their daily necessities in under five minutes, instead of just big buildings. An outside mirror facade gives it its distinct personality while fitting in with the environment. A group of famous architects and engineers will be involved in the development, according to NEOM. By considerably upgrading building technology and manufacturing processes, the city's design will be entirely digitalized and the construction will be industrialized significantly. The announcement of the line's designs is a continuation of NEOM's progress on the creation of its flagship projects, including Trojena, a global mountain tourism destination that will provide the first outdoor skiing in the Arabian Gulf, and Oxagon, its reimagined manufacturing and innovation city. NEOM has also recently launched two subsidiaries, Inoa, its energy, water and hydrogen company, and the NEOM Tech and Digital Company. How much will it cost to build? 
the estimated cost of the NEON project is 500 billion US dollars. This is a rough estimate, and the final figure could be higher or lower depending on several factors. The cost will be covered by a combination of public and private investment. The investment will be in the form of equity, debt financing, and contributions. For example, the government may provide certain services, e.g. security, or infrastructure for free. This investment could come from both domestic and foreign sources. It will take at least five years to raise the necessary investment. Who will build the project and when will construction start? The NEOM Consortium is led by Saudi Arabia's Sovereign Wealth Fund and includes investment and development partners from the US, Europe, the Middle East, and Asia. A group of international architects, engineers, planners, and urban designers have been working on building the NEOM Master Plan since November 2017. The consortium has pledged to begin construction on several priority projects by the end of 2019. These include the NEOM Cultural Center, the NEOM Gardens, the NEOM International Airport, and the NEOM Health City. The consortium will build infrastructure for about 40% of the project area, while private developers will build the rest. How long before we see the first results of the project? Construction on the first priority projects began towards the end of 2019. Once these are completed, they serve as models for the rest of the project. The NEOM project is expected to take at least 10 years to complete. The first stage of the project will focus on creating a new environment, followed by the development of the industrial parks. The last phase will focus on developing residential areas, cultural facilities, and sports tourism destinations. The NEON project is an ambitious initiative that has the potential to change the region's economic landscape. The project will be a home for greenfield investment projects in areas such as biotechnology, digital media, and artificial intelligence. It will also be used to develop new industries, including renewable energy and water sustainability. The project is expected to attract both domestic and foreign investors with a focus on technology innovation and new industries. It will serve as a model for other investment projects in other parts of Saudi Arabia. The original concept and vision of the line, which reframes the idea of urban development and what future cities should look like, was introduced in January of last year by His Royal Highness Mohammed bin Salman, the Crown Prince and Chairman of the NEOM Board of Directors. In his speech, he explained the magnificence of the NEOM line. He said, at the line's launch last year, we committed to a civilizational revolution that puts humans first based on a radical change in urban planning. He said, the designs revealed today for the city's vertically layered communities will challenge the traditional flat, horizontal cities and create a model for nature preservation and enhanced human livability. The line will tackle the challenges facing humanity in urban life today and will shine a light on alternative ways to live. We cannot ignore the livability and environmental crises facing our world's cities, and NEOM is at the forefront of delivering new and imaginative solutions to address these issues. NEOM is leading a team of the brightest minds in architecture, engineering, and construction to make the idea of building a reality upward. According to the NEOM Line's plans, there won't be any roads, cars, or emissions because it will be powered entirely by renewable energy, and 95% of the area will be set aside for natural habitat. In contrast to traditional cities, the health and welfare of the population will take precedence over infrastructure and transportation. Despite being 170 kilometers long and 500 meters above sea level, it's just 200 meters broad. The line will have a total capacity of 9 million people and be constructed on a 34 square kilometer area. This will result in a smaller infrastructure footprint and hitherto unheard of efficiencies in city operations. Residents will be able to take advantage of the nearby natural beauty thanks to the optimum environment all year round. Along with having access to high-speed rail, which takes 20 minutes to travel from point A to point B, residents will also be able to walk to all amenities. Hence, Still in the HRN's words, NEOM will be a place for all people from across the globe to make their mark on the world in creative, 
and innovative ways. NEOM remains one of the most important projects of Saudi Vision 2030, and our commitment to delivering the line on behalf of the nation remains resolute. With all these immense innovations, it is crystal clear that the future is perfect and perhaps most of our sci-fi innovations are gradually coming to life. The NEOM line is a technological leap that will blast the world and people into a better and more technologically enhanced future. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and share so you never miss our content.